Hi, and welcome to Horn Trader on YouTube. My special guest today, all the way from Europe, is the Hube Van Lahr B1 Flugelhorn. Uh, Hube undoubtedly makes one of the best flugelhorns in the world. It's a wonderful horn. Um, this is the B1, it's a little smaller than most of his horns, his flugelhorns. I think he has three, maybe four in his line. The B1 has a 413 bore size and just under six inch flare. One piece brass bell from the, ba the, the bell branch and the, uh, the kind of the heavy uh, ferrule. This all right here is one piece brass. Um, serial number on this horn is 41,494 and uh, comes with a trigger and a water key on the, um, uh, the bell branch and one on the third slide. This third slide is really nice and ergonomic, smooth. The horn's got lots of compression. Let me get the first slide now for you. Here's the second slide. Pop, thud. Mm -hmm. Got heavy uh, bottom caps as to the stability. And it's got some wide finger buttons that have a little bit of a convex shape, a little bit of a hump to them. Um, they're not bad, but if uh, they're, they get a little sweaty or moist, you could slip off of them. So that's something to watch for. The finish is darn near perfect, except one little dent right there, some slight hazing, a scratch, uh, light scratches. Everything might uh, will possibly come out with a, a talented technician. I don't see any real problems with it. Obviously nothing that affects the tone and the sound. It's just a beautiful playing horn. Let's check some of the um, money notes. For that low D, I had it out about a half an inch. Three quarters of an inch for that low C sharp D flat. For that low F sharp, I got it out about an inch and an eighth, um, which is all kind of in the acceptable territory for a flugelhorn. The um, the blow feels kind of open, yet there's a soft sponginess that you can blow against. It's got what I'd like to call a passive resistance. So it's a, it's a pretty special horn. Let's play it in a different key. beautiful playing flugelhorn. You can find it in the flugelhorn section at horntrader.com. Thanks a lot for your watching on YouTube, all your fine comments. I take everyone. I try to write to everybody who might leave a comment on YouTube. We appreciate your, uh, your thoughts. Thanks a lot. We'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.